Do you know this scientist? No, right? Come on, let's understand him. Hello students and welcome to my online biology classes. My name is Sanjay and this class name is Biology with Sanjay RJ. Today onwards we will be starting a new unit of biology NCERT and that is chapter number 1, the living world. The beginning of uh, the journey of meat, aims, gypmer, AFMC etc etc. And majority of the students fail to understand before starting to study this chapter and that is the mentioning of one of the best known scientists ever called as the Ernst Mayer. So today we'll be understanding him, we'll be understanding his birth, his contributions, his work analysis and his titles. The first thing is about Ernst Mayer. He was born on 5th July 1904, Kempton, Germany. He worked in the Harvard University. He followed Charles Darwin and his work. He followed the work ethics of Charles Darwin. Charles Darwin was so much interested in studying the evolution, in studying the origin of species of variety of organisms and he was very much interested in giving the world how actually the organisms created. Now, depending upon the interest of Charles Darwin's analysis of evolution, even the Ernst Mayer also took a specialized interest in understanding how actually this evolution went on. Now, while studying so, he was even interested in ornithology, taxonomy, zoo, geography, evolution, systematics, history and philosophy of biology. As I mentioned earlier that he worked in Harvard University in the department of arts and science in the year of 1953 and he got retired in 1975. Another point to be mentioned as the important point here is that Ernst Mayer was considered called renowned as the Darwin of 20th century. He even received a title called as Alexander Agassiz Professor of Zoology Emeritus. He was the person who gave the idea of the definition of the species or in other terms the modern biologists whatever they use the definition of biology was actually given by this scientist itself. That is, the species definition was given by Ernst Mayer itself, which the locally, currently, the entire world follows him. He even gave the definition of reproductive isolation also. Mayer was awarded with three prizes during his lifetime, which is even called as the triple crown of biology. The names are the Balzan Prize in 1983, the International Prize for Biology in 1994, the Crawford Prize in 1999. Mayer died at the age of 100 in the year of 2004. So students, this is a very smallest introduction about this uh, scientist who actually comes before the entry, before the beginning of this chapter that is the living world. About him that is uh, very very less information in NCRT as we keep on explaining about him it will take too many hours. Till that time do one thing like it, share it, subscribe it. I will definitely meet you in the next video that is a promise and till that time God bless you all.